If you're a fan of small dogs, there are surely several on your radar. Two very popular, very small dogs are the Maltese and the Bichon Frise. Through their searching, many people decide to go with one of these adorable breeds. If you're considering the pros and cons of the Bichon Frise versus Maltese, this is the guide for you. Appearance The head of a Maltese dog is a bit rounded in shape with a black nose, alert and dark eyes, and drooping ears. They are known for their silky white hair covering their entire body. Their hair touches the floor. They lack an undercoat, and this is the reason why they do not shed as such. Still, you have to bathe and groom them regularly. The Bichons are often mistaken for poodles because of their fluffy white coats and faces that resemble dolls that babies play with. They have thick double coats, and this is the reason why they have such luxurious locks. Their undercoat is dense and soft. Their outer coat spreads at a distance from their body. It is the reason why they look like powder puffs. Bichons are usually white. However, they can be pale yellow or cream colored as pups. Size Both Bichons and Maltese are small dogs. However, the latter is smaller. An adult Bichon could weigh anywhere between 6.6 .6 pounds and 11.01 pounds while an adult Maltese would never weigh more than 6.6 .6 pounds. The Maltese males are between 20 and 25 centimeters in height, and for the females, this range is 20 to 22 centimeters. The Bichons, both females and males, are a bit taller at between 22 and 27 centimeters. Lifespan These dogs are both small breeds with very similar lifespans. Bichon Frise typically live around 14 to 15 years. And Maltese breeds live for about 12 to 15 years. Grooming Both dogs are good breeds for people with allergies since Bichons shed only a little and what they do shed gets caught in their undercoat rather than falling on the floor. They also require a lot of grooming. A Bichon's coat needs to brush or comb frequently or it will lead to mats. They will need to be bathed regularly. As like a Maltese, their white coat has a tendency to get dirty. It's also important to keep a Maltese and Bichon's eyes clean as mucus can accumulate in their eyes and lead to eye problems. Family Bichons are wonderful as family pets. They also act as great companions for the kids in your home. They can tolerate rambunctious behavior. They would gel well with the other animals you have as pets. Hence, they are ideal for homes with multiple pets. On the other hand, since the Maltese are small dogs, they are not suitable for homes with children as they can get injured easily. They do not go well with other pets and children too. Exercise and Nutrition Being small dogs, neither Bichon requires a high exercise routine. In fact, because they are so active, nervous, and playful, they don't need additional training. However, Bichon Frise and Maltese both love walks and outdoor games, so it's a good idea to take this pet out for more than just the strictly necessary walks. As far as food is concerned, the Bichon Frise does not need a special diet, but, in the case of the Bichon Maltese, attention must be paid to crunchy foods so that it does not suffer from dental problems and it is also necessary to avoid overfeeding them. Both these toy breeds are adorable and it is difficult to choose one. Let us know which one you would prefer in comments section. Thanks for watching.